Hey guys, I'm Chef Z and today I am back with an all new episode here on Made to Order. I'm really excited to show you guys how to make coconut macaroons. Now the holidays are upon us, which means that holiday cookies are all the rave and I've developed a recipe that's pretty much modeled after one of my favorite candy bars, which is an Almond Joy. It has coconut, it has almonds, and it has chocolate. So if you can probably guess, my coconut macaroons have a hint of almonds, which by the way is totally optional, but it is to die for so i do encourage you guys to try it let's go ahead and jump right into this video i love making coconut macaroons because these macaroons are super easy to make and this is a no fuss recipe that you can whip up in no time we're now going to add some salt into the egg whites and using a hand mixer on medium to high speed we're going to whip these bad boys together for about three to five minutes until they create some stiff peaks now, you know you have stiff peaks when they have some tall mountains just like you see here, but more importantly, you still want your egg whites to have some kind of movement. Now we're going to add one of my all-time favorite ingredients. We're going to add some sweet condensed milk, and then to that, we're going to add just a little bit of vanilla extract, followed by a touch of almond extract because a little bit does go a long way. Keep in mind that the almond extract is optional. We're now going to mix this all together until it's well combined and please note that I am using unsweetened coconut but you can definitely use sweetened coconut if you like. I just recommend cutting back a little bit on the sweet condensed milk just so that you don't end up with the macaroon that's super super sweet. We're now going to very gently fold in the egg whites and using egg whites in this recipe is not totally necessary. I know people who don't actually even add the egg whites. If you're one of those people, then simply add some more sweet condensed milk just so that your cookie has enough binding agent to kind of hold it together while it's baking. And once that's set and ready to go, we're gonna take an ice cream scooper or you can use two spoons, whatever you have on hand, and we're going to form the perfectly shaped macaroon. We're gonna place it onto a baking sheet that's been lined with parchment paper or a silicone baking mat. Now, because I'm a little bit of a perfectionist, I do like to go in with two spoons and fix the shapes up just a little bit because I like the perfectly domed macaroon. And then once all of those have been set and inspected and perfected, we're now going to add that into the oven and we're gonna bake that at 325 degrees for about 20 minutes until our macaroons are nice and golden brown. And once the macaroons have set, we're now going to dip them into some melted chocolate. You can use whatever kind of chocolate you want. I'm using some semi-sweet dark chocolate. We're gonna scrape off the excess chocolate from the bottom and then we're gonna place them onto some parchment paper while they set. And then at the very end, we're going to drizzle some more chocolate. Now, if you are making these macaroons in a rush, I do recommend that you use some candy melts as opposed to some high grade chocolate, just like I'm doing here, just because a dark chocolate candy melt is going to set in like about 0.2 seconds, whereas a high grade chocolate, you're gonna wanna make this about the day before because it does take a little bit longer to set. So there you guys have it, my recipe for some coconut macaroons. I hope you enjoyed. Happy holidays, and I can't wait to see you guys next week with an all new video. Buen provecho, guys.